I don't know. I might need a haircut. I need a shave too, but we're not doing it now. We're making this damn video. Good God, man. Look at all the toys. Someone's got serious problems. Hmm. Hey, you know what? I didn't even think about the chair I'm sitting in. The price tag on this thing. We'll get into that later. This thing is pretty heavy, Bobby. I can do a one-arm workout with this box. That's right. Today is unboxing day. So you get a video. Thanks to Bobby. Thanks, Bobby. I just like to put point out, excuse me, Bobby wrote fragile, not just on this side of the box, but he wrote fragile on this side of the box, and fragile on this side of the box, and fragile on this side of the box. All four sides. You didn't write fragile on the bottom, Bobby, but he even took the time to write it on the top, too. That's dedication. Bobby. It's a shame I deleted all my videos, Bobby. Because I remember the last time you sent me some shit, Bobby. Vinny sent me a nice box of shit. Maniac Cop sent me a nice box of shit. Hell, Sean sent me a nice box of shit. And he hid money inside some of the shit he sent me. And then Jay sent me a box of shit. Eh, they were okay. You're kind of familiar with this kind of shit, aren't you, Bobby? Some nerd made this for me, Bobby. Did you, uh... Did you put any of this nerd shit like this in the box? The same guy that made this quilted a blanket for my girlfriend. Yeah. So I was going to save this for later. Uh, I was referencing the chair, just so you don't forget, because this video might go long. Uh, somebody wrote me, another homeless bum just discover the internet. Now here they are trying to insult me when they should have wrote another homeless bum just discovered the internet. Maybe it was the hair. Maybe it was the beard. Maybe he didn't understand sarcasm. Sitting! Which reminds me. There we go. Now I can look less like a bum, right? But I started to think about it. I was like, okay, what kind of insult is that? First, you didn't even write it correctly in the comment section. And look at the shit behind me on the wall. There's like over $3,500 just right here. I didn't even add up the video games, okay? I just kind of added up the toys. I didn't even put a price on the signed Bruce Campbell poster with the little picture with me and him in the corner, okay? That's right. Hail to the king, baby. Anyway, I just thought that was hilarious, and I'd share it with my subscribers. Now, before we get into this box that says Fragile on it, all right? That's a, that's a heavy box. You can do some workouts with this box right here, Bobby. That's right, Bobby. Do some workouts right there. All right, I'm not going to throw it down because it says Fragile. All right, so let me get this straight. $25 billion on a border wall. 8 billion on Space Force and about 92 million for a parade. Hell, you ain't down with that. You ain't a patriotic American. Okay, let me get this straight. So we got somebody that wants to spend 25 billion for a border wall, 8 billion for a Space Force, because God knows we hate all aliens, <laughs> and 92 million for a parade that should have been about 12 million. But the Department of Defense and the interagency programs. I think it's partners, not programs. Told it to be $92 million. But think how cool that would be. Helicopters, fighter jets, tanks tearing up the infrastructure. Because an Abrams tank is just 70 tons, jackass. Yes, an Abrams tank is just shy of 70 tons. Can we just buy the jackass a copy of Call of Duty and call it a day? How about Cadet Bone Spurs just have everybody come into the Oval Office and salute him while he plays with G.I. Joes? Maybe Putin can load us out the Russian military. Ha ha ha! Putin. So let me get this straight. We don't have money for vets. But plenty for a military parade. Ha ha ha! Get the fuck out of here! Yes, I'm criticizing Donald Trump. Does that mean I lose security clearance? Ha ha! Damn it, and I wanted to see how we divvy out 717 billion on a defense budget. Does any of that pay for abortions of Playboy models and porn stars? Oh, don't worry. We're going to get into this broken mess in a minute. Mom, Mom, it looks like I'm watching a broken mess. Hey, but at least our military gets a 2.6 inch, 6 inch. I'm sorry, all that talk of porn stars and 
Playboy models. Our military men and women will be getting a 2.6% raise starting in January 2019. That had nothing to do with anybody's little hands or dick. <laughs> because let's be honest, it's not like we have, uh, what, 40,000 homeless vets? No less veterans with high suicide rates, veterans with drug addictions. Yeah, fuck it, let's spend 92 million for a parade. Why not? You already run a circus. <laughs> but let's get to the real money issue. They were going to pay... St I was going to say Stormy Daniels. They were going to pay Omarosa $15,000 a month to keep her mouth shut. $15,000 to do nothing. Nothing. Just like some of these YouTubers that regurgitate video game articles. Ching! But it wasn't a payout because they cared so much about her personality. Was that hard for her to say? I mean, seriously, are you kidding me? She has a personality of a tree-hugging koala. It's like if you mixed a koala with a beaver and uh, a Nazi super cow. Added in a dolphin and a touch of prairie dog and a slow lores. Then tossed in a swan and a hippopotamus. And you'd have the jelly roll that is Amarosa. China? China? Amarosa? Amarosa? What's wrong with this guy? Nothing. China, China, Omarosa, Omarosa, Oprah, Oprah. Omarosa might be the new black Monica Lewinsky, only she hit a tape recorder instead of a cigar. At least she didn't have to blow anybody nine times for $150,000. <laughs> but honestly, guys, what we really need to focus on here is negative video game clickbait drama. How about entitled clickbait millennial bullshit? Why I'm mad about this video game! Don't you want to know why your favorite basement dwelling regurgitating video game YouTuber is angry in regards to video games? Because it's a big deal, people! Video game companies are pissing me off! Who gives a shit? They want to spend 25 billion on a wall. It's not even really a wall, it's a fence. But Spyro the Dragon is delayed! Who gives a shit about Puerto Rico? We got an eight billion dollar Space Force to build. Space Force. Let's not forget that wall. Damn Mexicans. But seriously guys, we gotta talk about things that really matter. Like uh, video game rumors right now before they blow up later and other people make videos on the shit I'm making a video about right now. But I'm still torn between the 25 mil on a wall, the eight billion for a fucking Space Force and then what was it like uh, 92 million for a narcissist parade. I mean, why fix Flint's old water pipes before 2020? Yeah, they're not all going to get replaced until 2020. And let's not forget that $717 billion for the defense freaking budget. America. Oh, wait a minute. This is YouTube. I'm so sick of random video game delays. Damn it. I'm entitled. It's all about me. Oh, don't worry. We're going to get into this, Bobby. How dare video game developers delay a game to make it better? It was supposed to come out now. Why? Why did you do this to me? Clearly I have so much time on my hands because I make YouTube videos for a living. I needed that one game. That one game. Hey, I'm a video game YouTuber, damn it. And I play video games and I make YouTube videos. So, so I think I know how the video game industry works. And because I reread video game articles. Ah. EA's evil! Activision bad! Something with the title Social Justice Warriors? Let's all grab the pitchforks! Anyway, can we still bitch about Philip? I think we can. Make no mistake though, I'm doing it for ad revenue and clickbait. Let's get outrage! Protest! Thank God for Twitter. I'm angry! I feel just like 45! Great, now I'm out $130,000. Let's boycott Sam Adams' beer because we're idiots. And because we're all dumbed down as a society, Let's watch Celebrity Big Brother. And speaking of Celebrity Big Brother, Stormy Daniels pulled out of that quicker than Donald Trump. Thank you. I'll be here all week. She literally pulled out of the show right before they were going to go live. She also pulled out of a TV appearance for a show called, get this, Loose Women. That's a joke that writes itself. Come on, you can't make this shit up, people. Alright, now that my opening monologue is over, 
time to get into this box. Okay, the epileptic's head is getting too hot. We're getting rid of the beanie, and you're just going to have to deal with the hair. Let's do this. I only know of one item that is in here that Bobby sent me. Don't do this at home, kiddos. At least not with a sharp knife. So what do we have in this box of trash, Bobby? You gotta be careful, make sure we don't get Bobby's address because then the next thing you know, somebody will be stalking him. So let's take care of this right now. There you go, Bobby. So the one item that I knew was gonna be in here and is still in the shrink wrap. The original Netflix series, Stranger Things, in this really cool VHS type case. Even though I think it's bigger than a VHS. So that disappoints me, Bobby. Uh, the last box Bobby sent me, he sent me the Blu-rays. I don't know how he got a hold of those, and then somebody got him the 4K, and then I'm going to send him the Blu-rays back, and he's sending me the 4K with the Blu-ray right here, which is in this white box. Now, here's the Blu-ray set that he sent me. I like the black box better because it also has a more worn, tattered look to it because of it being black. Uh but it had a nice dent in it which really disappointed me because i wouldn't have done that to it uh so now i have one that's dent free uh i would have kept that case and actually sent bobby this cover and kept that black case but since this is in better shape we're gonna keep this one bobby now we've got some goodies in here most of it all fucking trash, let's be honest. Seriously? NBA courtside on the Nintendo 64? Trash. Is there any more trash in here, Bobby? Hole-in-one golf? Uh, looks like trash. Plus, I already bought it, Bobby. What does this look like, Bobby? What does this look like? Doesn't look like this trash, does it? What is this GameStop used sticker shit? Seriously? You're gonna send me games? This is how you send me games, Bobby. What are you doing to me, Bobby? Do you see this game, Bobby? Do you see this game? It's right here, Bobby. More trash. What else do we got here? Oh, look at that. It's a PlayStation game. WWF Attitude. Really, Bobby? Why the hell would I want to play this when I have this right here, Bobby? Seriously. You know what this has, Bobby? Let's look inside. An instruction booklet. You know what this doesn't have, Bobby? An instruction booklet. That's what I think of that, Bobby. What else do we have in this box of trash? John Madden football. Why in the hell would I play John Madden football on the Super Nintendo? No less with all this dust, seriously? If I'm going to play John Madden football, Bobby, then I'm going to play it the right way on the Sega Genesis. Who plays EA Sports games on the Super Nintendo? <laughs> Peasants! That's who. What else is in this box of trash? Oh, look at this pristine copy of fucking Killer Instinct. Wow, I mean, that's fantastic. The level of dust on there. How great the sticker is. Seriously? Are you just mailing me your trash at this point? Look at my pristine copy of Killer Instinct. You want to send me something, Bobby? Send me the Killer Cuts music CD that I didn't get with this. That's what you can send me, Bobby. So, uh, yeah. So what else is in here? Oh, NCAA basketball. Great, thanks. What else is in here? Uh, NBA Jam. Uh, hmm, I wonder if I have that, Bobby. Oh, you know what I don't have, though? I don't have a copy with John Martinez's name written across it in permanent marker. Thanks, Bobby. Oh, look at that. I do have a copy of NBA Jam.
and John Martinez's name isn't written on the back in Sharpie. I'm afraid to put my hand back in here. NHL 96, once again, why would I play this on the Super Nintendo when I could play it on the Sega Genesis? Maybe because this copy looks like, I don't know, somebody directly blew cancer onto it. Has a nice thick layer of dust again. Thanks, Bobby. What else do we got? Oh, look at that. Madden 95 on the Super Nintendo. Thanks, Bobby. I never would have bought this on the Super Nintendo because I own it on the Sega Genesis. But I guess I'll keep that one. So thanks. Oh, here's a game I don't have. Street Fighter 2. Thanks for sending me the box and the book with it. Or do I have that? So why would I want an original copy of Street Fighter 2 missing the manual and the box when I've got this glow-in-the-dark green version with this foil box cover? Bobby. Can't really answer that now, can you? Exactly. And I'm looking in this box, and you know, you know what I don't see? I don't see a bunch of Sega games, okay? I see one Sega game in here, Bobby. One. Does it have the book with it? I think it feels like it has the book. Look at that. Look at that. Did you dip this book in the toilet before you sent it to me? I think you did. Steel Talons. Fly with the Army's most advanced attack helicopter without enlisting. Hey, maybe I should mail this to Donald Trump. That's a nice looking cartridge, Bobby. It's a nice looking cartridge. You finally did something right. But somebody scratched out the barcode with a magic marker, Bobby. And who cut off this tab? I mean, seriously, Michael J. Fox? What is this? I just pulled this. What is this? Super Mario made for McDonald's 2018 made in China. What is this? This is not a video game, Bobby. Okay, just because it has Mario on it, 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 it's not classified as a video game, okay? What is this? He doesn't even move. He's stationary. More crap. What is this? Did you put your kids' toys in this box? Your little girl is going to be so upset when she can't find her Mario plastic fucking blocks. How old do you think I am? There's more. What? I collect real toys, Bobby. These are real toys. These are statues, okay? These aren't kids and playthings. But let's open one up. Okay, this Mario's cool. Maybe I'll send it to Michael. Michael likes this kind of kitty shit. But what is he wearing on his head? Oh, he's hitting a block. And then it's doing the little... Now that's, that's kind of cool. Except for the fact that... Oh, he does stand. Okay, all right, Bobby. I'll give you that one. That's pretty cool. Where'd you get this? This is another McDonald's toy made in China. You thought you were going to get rich quick with this shit and sell it on the internet? Yeah, you got it from a Happy Meal. Your kid already had one, so you gave me the second one? Thanks for looking out for me, Bobby. Oh, and you sent another one. Yoshi. I guess I'll give this to my girlfriend. What is this nonsense? More nonsense. His arms don't even move, and he has a permanent cloud stuck to his ass. Thanks, Bobby. I see something that looks decent. It's Star Fox. And you know what it has on it? It has a dust cover on it, Bobby. But here's the problem. It looks like it sat outside in somebody's garage for 10 years before anybody put the fucking dust cover on it. Okay? So what's the point of sending me the fucking dust cover? 
Can you explain that? Because I don't understand it. It's like the guy that wears his pants around his fucking ass, yet he has a belt on. It makes no fucking sense, okay? Thanks again, Bobby. There's another good game in here. Uh, Super Mario World. Don't have that. Uh, I like the snot stains on the back of it and the discoloration and the crap that's embedded on the cartridge. And uh, it looks like I'll need to clean it for about a week. Thanks, Bobby. Oh, and here's, here's a cartridge I don't have that looks like it was left out in the sun and then... I don't know what in the hell that is inside the cartridge, but I bet if I take it apart, that crap that is on the clip of the cartridge is probably on the inside of the cartridge, too. Man, people just did not take care of these. Yet, yet Super Nintendo games on eBay with a paper fucking box and a little shitty instruction manual go for way too much money. Uh, when usually the Sega Genesis version is better, let's be honest. And then what do we got here? We have a uh, Ultraman. I'll give it a shot. Thanks, Bobby. Looks like there's something in here for my girlfriend. So I'll pull that out. Probably already made these. Doesn't look like you bothered to make the one I asked you to make for my girlfriend, so thanks. Uh, but at least you made this one. Thanks, Bobby. That's pretty damn cool. Look at that. That's pretty cool. That was a special request. So, there you go. Can you hurry up already and pick that ugly piece of shit off the carpet? Thank oh, is this still on? Hey, look at this one right here. Pretty cool, Bobby. Here's another one for the girlfriend. Uh, can, can you make her counterpart, please? Because it, I just, it feels lost. Okay? So, there you go. Hope it didn't snap in half. And if it did, I don't give a shit, Bobby. Oh, so Bobby finally sends me the book to the Lion King. But guess what I don't have? Box, Bobby. Okay? But I do still have the Lion King. And guess what? It's right in front of me. It's right in this box over here. This is actually, I, st I still need to clean this one from the last unboxing, okay? The ones I cleaned immediately were the ones with cases, instruction manuals. I cleaned those right away, played them, and put them in my collection. Didn't complete them, just popped them in, played them, listened to the music. Ah. Uh... Hey, at least I got a book now. That's cool. Thanks, brother. Uh, what do we got here? We got HBO Boxing for the PlayStation. Gee, thanks. What else do we have? Uh, Golden Nugget. Uh, Las Vegas style casino gambling. I'll make sure and never lend this out to Donald Trump because then I'll never see it again. But there's white trash out there, Bobby, that thinks just because he bought this makes him a very savvy businessman. Why are you sending me sealed computer games? Just, just why, Bobby? Oh, and look at that. An interactive CD sampler. Volume 3? Say it ain't so, Bobby. And, and it's tore up. Just the way I like it. Pizza Hut, disc 1. Interactive CD Sampler Pack, Volume 3. Wow. Are you serious with this shit, Bobby? Now I've got myself, Bobby. Son of a bitch. What else is in this box of trash? Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, The First Battle. It's a children's book. It's Ninja Turtles. It's a children's book. That's Ninja Turtles. Okay then.
we'll forget all about that. What else is in here? See more books, but I see what looks like two more games. Why don't you send me this shit on the Sega Saturn, Bobby? Well, at least this one actually comes in a case with the book. The game's not scratched up. Looks like somebody put their fingerprints all over it, but hey, those come off. What else do we got? Power Serve 3D Tennis. It's acceptable, Bobby. Okay, let's dig these books out. What do we got? Why would you send me a comic book that doesn't have a cardboard backer and a plastic sleeve? What is wrong with you, man? No less, you wrote fragile, but there wasn't even any bubble wrap in this. There wasn't even paper. I ordered a $150 pair of shoes. You know what it came with? Paper, Bobby, paper. You're putting classic video games in here. You write fragile all over the box, but then you don't even bother to pack it like it's fragile. Tell me how that makes any sense, Bobby. All right, let me look at it. Yeah, isn't that nice? What's next? Okay, that looks cool. That looks very cool. And I used to have that when I was a kid, Bobby. Okay, the sticker is on the outside, not on the comic itself. And they taped it correctly. I couldn't stand, I go over to somebody's house that collected comics and they would tape the tape right here, Bobby. Okay, you tape the tape on the side. To so use good tape, then you just whoosh, real quick, slip it out. That is super cool. That is super cool. And I drew this years ago. I have those drawings in the closet. Man, get this out on 4K Ultra HD, Warner Brothers. At least part one and part two. Get this out. And of course, the original Superman. What else do we got in here? Oh, look at that. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. ABC for a better planet. Kidding me with this shit, Bobby. What else do we have in here, Bobby? I didn't go to the gym today, Bobby. I skipped the gym just to come home and unbox all this shit, okay? You know what's gonna happen to me? I'm gonna gain like 200 pounds. But then I can regurgitate video game articles. Hey, so I guess there's a trade-off. Silly me. Sorry, I didn't mean to get upset. Uh, Shredder gets splintered. Is this a coloring book? It's a coloring book that apparently your small child or rats already chewed on, okay? And here's a problem with this coloring book. Who colors a Ninja Turtle red and fucking orange? First off, Bobby. Okay, so now that's ruined. What if I wanted to color all of these? Okay? Not that I color in coloring books. I'm just a grown man that hangs toys on the fucking wall. Okay? Can you stop disturbing me while I'm looking at the coloring book? I know you want to color in it. Okay? Look, and then they color through it to where it bleeds through all the other pages. Thanks, Bobby. So if that's not a problem, because I'm a perfectionist, and I'd like to color through the whole thing if I was gonna color it. You've got this. Did, did you have your little girl color in it before you sent it to me? If so, it's, it's beautiful. If your wife did it, it sucks, okay? She's a grown woman, Teach her how to color properly and tell her to finish the whole drawing before you send it to me. Oh, here we go again with this nonsense. This coloring book is ruined. Ruined. 
Sweetie. Hey, it looks like Bobby sent you uh, this coloring booklet. What else do we have? Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, the storybook based on the movie. You know, even though I'm epileptic, Bobby, I can read. You can send me a real book, okay? My learning disability involves math. That's it. Just math. Man, this video's been 30 minutes. Time to wrap it up. Bobby's last item in here is Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, the magic crystal. Okay, I might be able to spank one off to this, so thanks, Bobby. That's really cool. Anyway, guys, hope you've enjoyed the video. Take care, and have a fantastic day. Thanks, Bobby.